A home equity loan versus a home equity line of credit. What's the difference? Which one should you use? Or are they the same thing? Let's get into it. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. My name's Jay Casa, and if you get any value out of this video at all, please smash that like button down below. Would truly, truly appreciate it, and it really helps me grow the channel. So the last couple of years with home values skyrocketing and now mortgage rates skyrocketing along with it, let's call it like it is, the cash out refinance is pretty much dead. So everyone's trying different ways to tap into that equity, that newfound equity that they now have in their home. Now I've made numerous videos on my preferred method of doing this, and that's the home equity line of credit or the HELOC for short. If you wanna learn more specifically about the HELOC, check the links in the description box down below. I definitely recommend you check those out. You'll learn about what a HELOC is, how to apply for one, what a HELOC is compared to a cash out refinance, as well as how to use it to pay off your mortgage faster and how to use a HELOC to start investing in real estate. So definitely recommended that you go check those out. But in this video, we're gonna go over the HELOC compared to the home equity loan. Now, a lot of people use these terms interchangeably, thinking that they're the same thing. Well, let me just say they're not the same thing. So first, let's start with a HELOC. A HELOC is a revolving credit line based on the equity of your home. And you could take money out and pay it back. It's really almost like a credit card and you could use it for whatever you want. For the first 10 years, it's an interest only payment. And that interest is based on what's called an average daily balance. But the rate of interest on a HELOC is variable. It's based on the prime rate plus a certain spread. So you definitely need to keep that in mind based on what your plans and goals are. That interest rate can and will change. Now, on the other hand, you have the home equity loan. Well, what is a home equity loan? Well, a home equity loan is kind of exactly what it sounds like. Instead of being a revolving line of credit like a credit card uh, that the HELOC is, it's basically a close-ended loan and it's amortized kind of like a regular loan or regular mortgage. It's amortized anywhere from five up to 30 years, and it's a one-time loan, and you're paying interest at a set fixed interest rate, which is usually lower than what the HELOC would be, but it's not based off of the, an average daily balance where you can take money out and put it back, okay? It's based on whatever the loan amount is. So let's say you want to put a pool in your house, and it's 80 grand, let's say. It's a nice pool. With the home equity loan, the bank will give you a check for that 80 grand. And once you get that money, you're paying interest on it right away and you have a fixed payment. Now, there's some benefits to that because, it, like I said, it's a fixed payment and it's a fixed rate. It's not going up, so you know exactly what you're going to have to pay back. And like I said, the home equity loan usually has a little bit lower of an interest rate when compared to the home equity line of credit because the home equity line of credit tends to be thought of as a little bit more riskier. But if you take that same pool, that $80,000 pool, and you use a home equity line of credit on it, like I said, a home equity line of credit is a revolving credit line. So you could take Let's say you start off by just taking, uh, giving a deposit to the pool guy of 20 grand. So you just take that 20 grand out first and you're only paying interest on that 20 grand for the first X amount of weeks. And then you need another 20, so you take another 20 out, okay? And that's 40. You're only paying interest on 40 grand now, not the full 80. So even though the interest rate on a HELOC is higher, there's more flexibility and liquidity uh, uh, that you're able to use in these sorts of situations. And also, again, a home equity loan is a closed-ended loan. They give you that $80,000 check. Once you pay it back, it's done. A home equity line of credit, a HELOC, is an open revolving credit line. So you could take that 80 grand out to get the to get the pool, okay? You pay it all back and you still have that 80 grand of equity that you're able to tap into at any time after that. So when should you use a home equity loan over a home equity line of credit? Well, as you could probably tell, I'm a bigger, much bigger fan of a HELOC over a home equity loan, at least for what I do. It just gives more flexibility and more liquidity. It gives me more options in order to move money around and use that money to my benefit, whether it's to invest or if it's just to you know do an improvement or whatever I need it for short term. But if, like I said, you're only looking, if you're not a real estate investor, you're not looking to make money with this equity and you just want that equity to tap into to put an improvement on your home, like our, our example of a pool or a kitchen or a bathrooms, whatever, and you know you're only gonna wanna use it for, you just need some money for a one-time thing, you may wanna look at a home equity loan because like I said, it's a fixed rate and a fixed payment. You know exactly what you have to pay back. It's a one-time deal and you're done. 
But on the other side, when should you use a HELOC over a home equity loan? Well, pretty much if you're an investor of any kind, you should definitely use the home equity line of credit over the home equity loan because I, I feel like I'm a broken record, but it's just so much more flexible and it gives you so much more liquidity. And it, 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 you have this uh, revolving credit line for up to 20 years that you could uh, take money out and pay it down as you see fit. Let's say that you come across a good opportunity to uh, uh, purchase a, uh, a, a fix and flip project, okay? Let's say you buy the, the, uh, the property, your normal, whether it's cash or a normal mortgage or whatever, but let's say you need 100 grand to fix this place up. Well, you're not, you don't want to go get a $100,000 uh, loan somewhere else. You may want to take that 100 grand out of your line of credit short term. Okay, you use it, you renovate the property, and then you pay it back when you sell the property. Home equity line of credit can really be used in, a, in tremendous ways to build wealth, but it could also be used in negative ways as well. I definitely wouldn't suggest using a line of credit or a home equity loan or anything for that matter on vacations and depreciating assets. If you're gonna use it, you need to use it for something that at least makes you money and put into uh, appreciating assets, not depreciating assets. So that is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I apologize for the little nasally voice and no video last week. My daughter got me sick. It is what it is. Actually, she's in the other room. I have to go take care of her right now. But let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Home equity line of credit, home equity loan. Do you have any experience with either of them? Which one do you prefer? If you have any questions, let me know. Shoot me a question in the comment section down below as well. Would love to help you out in any way that I can. I've been using my home equity loan, uh, excuse me, my home equity line of credit for a while now, and it's really been very helpful in a lot of different ways, both investing as well as just uh, everyday, uh, not everyday expense, but a couple emergency situations, quote unquote emergency situations I use it for, really, really gives you a lot of options and liquidity um, that makes your life a little bit easier. So let me know in the comment section, and I will see you next time.